Morocco Swallows has done so well over the past few weeks to be in the news cycle. They're always in the news cycle. Comes Steve has joined in Morocco Swallows. They rebranded to, to no, Steve joined Swallows FC. They rebranded to Morocco Swallows, reclaiming the old name. Um, they signed on Dile Charlie, a big, a big catch um, in South African football. And now they've decided to announce their new technical sponsor. So whoever's doing marketing and PR over there by Swallows, hi guys, they're killing it because that's all we're speaking about now. Um, this deal is very interesting. It's interesting on a couple of fronts. Firstly, it's good to see local brands get a chance um, at the PSL, right? A lot of the times we go with the Pumas, we go with the Nikes, we go with the Adidases, and we want to go that route. But of late, it seems as though the more unfancied brands, Kappa, for example, and the more unlikely people, Drip in this example, are now taking hold over there in the PSL. So it's very interesting to see what Drip is going to give. For those who don't know, Drip is a footwear company, um, primarily, and it's going to be it's going to be fun to see what they design and give to the teams. Also, this is very interesting because in as much as we love the old guys, I believe Iswalos was the Ambro, earlier on the truth is a lot of these teams don't necessarily have technical sponsors right they have a lot of the teams have um partnerships where it's a discount we discount you you're still buying the stuff um and then we give you a discount and then we call that a sponsorship right that's where most teams are sitting especially sponsorship wise so to see these type of deals is very good because then it might cause the other guys to have to pull up their socks, right? Um, and, and, and step into the ring like that. So it's going to be, it's going to be fun to see what they're going to be able to pull out there by drip. This is not the first sponsorship, sports sponsorship that drip has. They did sponsor Eagles. There was an Eagles team in the SAB league, if I'm not mistaken. And then also, they also sponsored the Lions, but they're, they're the official sneaker partner of the Lions. The, the, the cricket team. So let's see um, what everybody's saying in the comments. It's good to be back, Hendrik. How are you doing? Um, how are you doing, Chene? Well done, Mr. Lekau and the Duba Birds. Support local brands. So yeah, it's going to be fun to see. Um, Chiefs obviously moved over to Kappa. It seems as though the time is up for brands like Nike, Adidas, and those guys. If they're not going to hold on to the big guys like your Orlando Pirates and stuff like that, um, it seems that teams are willing to move past them now. And we'll go from there. Sizwe, how are you doing? How are you doing? How are you doing? I'm going to open up the panel so we can have a quick chat um, about this new acquisition by e Itrip. Guys, please remember that you have to be following me in order to join my panel. Um, and yeah, we can speak when you get on. Guys, on Facebook, if you are hearing voices and you're wondering what are, where are these voices coming from, uh, you have to be on TikTok in order for you to join. And then I can bring you in and you can actually lend your voice to the show. Guys, if you haven't followed, please follow. Uh, while I'm here, let me let in the guys on the panel. Okay. Okay, there we go. Prampo, welcome to the show, my brother. How are you doing? Good, buddy. How are you? And uh, no. each and every one of these. No, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. So let's get straight into it. How do you feel about this uh, announcement by Morocco Swallows? No, to them, you know, which is good when it comes to supporting locally, I understand. And yeah. the dream now will be global. Mm -hmm. the, most of the time, we will start knowing their brand. Mm -hmm. But the only thing, like you mentioned, this big brand, Puma, Nike, Adidas. Yeah. I you know like I wish this uh drip was or ever cup. They have to design a soccer boots. Okay. Because you can see chiefs, they're still wearing uh, uh, you know Nike. You ask <laughs> yourself what kind of deities was signed there? Is Nike said, Okay, I'll give you a soccer boots. You wear other you know, like that's a problem that I kinda like heavy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this, this big brand, they are making money on soccer boots. Mm, 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 mm. Because like a CR uh, CR7 soccer boots, mm. 
it's about seven, uh, four or five grand. One yeah, pay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. as a professional player, how many times you we play, we play with one yeah, pay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And as a yeah. professional player, how many times you we play? Let me just let me just mute there. I think with the with the Kappa and Chiefs thing, um, I believe that the deals don't stretch to players. So I think the players get to choose what boots they want to wear. And a lot of them are not going to go with Kappa. And some of them, some, have um, some deals with these companies. I know ooh, Dupre and now, I think it was Puma for Dupre or something like that. Yeah. They gave him some stuff. So I think the deal doesn't stretch to boots. I think it's just going to stay with the clothing and things like that. And then if you if the Chiefs player wants to wear the Kappa boots, they go ahead and wear the Kappa boots. You know, the question goes to the point. Mm. Let's say what uh, your point that you are making. Let's say mm, mm, mm. the senior players, they yeah. can choose the which brand they prefer. Mm, because mm, mm. when you said technical team, technical mm. sponsor, mm. what about from uh, under 15 and under 23? Yeah, if, that if one, you can yeah. see this point, mm. they're still wearing, uh, uh, you know, uh, what do you call the, this international brand. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, I think it's like now maybe this, uh, uh, like a trip. They can go to China. I know they go to China and get this Chinese <laughs> design them, you know. Sky is as well. No, you know, like, I don't want, I can, t- I can tell you off air. I mm. know where this thing comes from, but uh, mm-hmm. I don't want to say in the public domain. Okay. I no, no. <laughs> no. No, no stress from Paul. Let me bring in you, Hendrik. Hendrik, welcome to the show, my brother. Long time, long see. Hey, it's been a minute since I was here, guys. I oh. missed you all. How was it? How was it? No, we're good. How are you? I'm excellent, man. I'm excellent. Yeah, I'm very happy with uh, Morocco Swallows. The real Morocco Swallows is back. Yeah. So, so I'm pretty much happy. Uh, and then the, te- the the new sponsor deal, ooh, I did not expect it. And then I think, Uri, we must just... Uh, like relax drip is gonna obviously start manuf- manufacturing um uh the working the the, the 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 boots i think yeah. they might be doing so if this thing uh goes the way that they expect it to go i okay. think the naginano because uh as you know like people who follow the news and local news you know that drip at the moment uh, the owner is in a uh, in 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 court, if I'm not mistaken, yeah, or yes. there's a controversy between the girlfriend, what what about mm, mm, who started mm, years. Mm. So I think we're, as soon as this whole thing is done, they're gonna focus on what to do next. But okay. I do believe we're, it's 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 a sport. This is this is a, a, a soccer club, so obviously there must be footwear. So mm, I believe mm, we're maybe in the ongoing. Maybe they are still designing it. Who mm. knows? Maybe they are still designing it, but I believe what they're gonna design it, and then okay. it will be the cheapest uh, 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 soccer boots ever, and then it will also benefit um, uh, the teams that are playing in the locations. You understand? Because mm. Drip is one of the most uh, cheapest brand ever. If we are, if, if if we are being honest, it's 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 proper, but it's cheap. You understand? Mm. So mm. I believe what uh, baby steps, and then they will do it because. Now they are in 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 a place where they must start with the kit, like let's yeah. say for example uh, the shirt and everything, and then they must go to jerseys. And then once they get big, I'm sure that boots will will start piling in. I'm pretty mm-hmm. much sure if people can, uh, if 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 drip maybe can can start creating boots. I'm pretty mm-hmm. much sure they uh, like they will be sub, uh, supported locally because hey ama take is ama take adidas ya dura but ya dura take is adidas it take it a nike they are dura because they are rebranded after go bo venetia's junior ya bo mbappe bo haland so this one is drip Boom. Mm. Yeah, but 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 so in the loca on the location they can even afford them. But so in the location, yeah, so but it, it's it's fine if they can they can establish this brand from from. I kapaya tura lo na poto bor balibele ti defector chiefs is behind it yo tura lo na kap so no I just think that this one will be the cheapest this I I I I, I do believe for bato bato designer the boots and I believe for the boots that they will be designing will be the cheapest and then they will be affordable watch the space okay okay no I hear you uh thank you so much Cizwe for the gift um Chwene welcome to the show my brother how are you doing I'm alright I'm alright good evening everyone. Tell me what you think of this this announcement by Swallows. It's a bit of a premature announcement. 
Um, okay. I don't know lie. Um, I'm really not even holding my breath um, mm, with mm, regards mm. to that. Um, mm. uh, and, I, and I'll tell you why. Um, you know, when you say you're a technical sponsor, um, there's a lot that's involved in being okay. a technical sponsor. Mm. And looking at DRIP, their business model, mm. and the controversy of them going to courts, mm, um, mm. they had another business that they opened where they wanted to do... The kiddies, the kiddies clothes. Work. Yeah. Yes, and they're now liquidating it because mm, mm, uh, it, it was a flop. Mm, you know, now they're mm. going into a market. I don't know how well... Um, they understand and know this footballing market. Okay. Um, and I don't know if they did enough research to say, okay, so I know there's so many teams uh, in terms of uh, maybe the under 13s, and yeah. 17s, you know, under 19s, the MDC. Mm-hmm. Um, the first team, you know, how many players in total, mm-hmm. how many technical staff members we have, mm-hmm. because now they have to have home and away kids training mm. kids, you know, your bibs, you know, socks. Um, it's, it's it's a lot. And, mm. and, and I don't think it's going to make financial sense for Drip unless um, there's something that they're not telling us, you know. Mm. Um, but it's mm-hmm. for another day. Uh, okay. But I'm not really holding my breath because of this. Um, I, I, look, I have nothing against local brands. Mm. But another thing is that um, the Drip is is literally at at a toddler phase. They're at a toddler stage. They're very, mm. very young in the market. Mm. You know, they don't even have production houses in South Africa. Mm. You know, and, and, and going now for such a, a, a big, I would say, you know, contract or opportunity, mm. you know, um, I think it's, it's, it's a bit far-fetched. Okay. Um, but I hope it works for them. You know, it's a deal that would work for them. It's a right deal for them. Um, and again, looking at return on investment, a team like Morocco Suelos, uh, look, it it was Morocco Suelos dissolved. You know, then it was Suelos FC. Now we're coming back to Morocco Suelos. Mm. Um, and, and there's a lot of issues with regards to the patent and the use of that name, you know. Mm. Um, mm. But I'm glad they managed to get it back. Um that would mean that um, Morocco Suelos, in terms of being paid dividends by, by the league, they, they yeah. will be the highest paid because they would be the uh, longest uh, registered team, you know, mm-hmm. in, 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 the, in, the, in the Premier League. You mm-hmm. know, I think that counts also uh, in terms of how they remunerate the teams. Okay. Um, but yeah, I'm 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 not sold by this deal. I don't want to lie. Um, mm-hmm. We'll see. I mean, to, to manufacture a boot... You know, um, it's it, it's a lot of work, you know, because these guys are playing in the highest league. It has yeah. to be the best quality, yeah. you know. Um, yeah, so we'll see. But as, as okay. for me personally, I saw this and I was like, ah, there's another one of those, um, uh, what you call this? Um, okay, fly by night. Yeah, not even a fly by night. <laughs> it's it's just one of those deals where we get into the boardroom and, and we, we exchange ideas and we think we can execute it, you know, without even proper planning. Mm. Um, but I just hope for their sake it works out because it would be a disaster, you know, for this to, to fail at the last minute because, mm. as you can see, I think it's a bit of a last-minute deal. Mm. It's a hush-hush deal, you know, mm. I think Morocco Soros couldn't secure a, a sponsor and, and, and they call these guys in to say, guys, uh, what can you do for us? You mm. know, and now it's ideas that have been brainstormed that they're trying mm. to execute, but I don't think the rollout plan they have enough time to roll out the plan. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna touch on that, I'm gonna come back to that, let me bring them from, so, welcome to the show, how are you doing? I'm good. No, I grand, Prami grand. Uting all in the way trip. No. Okay. I think. Oh no, I'm supporting this one. Okay. I think this one. Uh, Mina on my side. I think this is a very, is a very good move in Morocco to lose. Uh, mm. to collaborate no mundo or local. So in terms of um, um, boots or or um, soccer boots, yeah. 
I think this guy must think like I think I have a strategy for him because okay. uh, in South Africa we have different types of soils. Ne? Mm -hmm. He must say what he he will create ama put maybe if soil is Devon we know what Mshaba to say Devon or Fan or C Josie no C Limpopo Ushugil so he will ama put that will support he must say that. Mm -hmm. I will create ama put that will support what must Devon or if it's raining. We have these kinds of puts, a South African put for a South African soil. Mm -hmm. I think that is a strategy. Mm -hmm. And then okay. another thing, yeah. I also think in Dubai cheese, I think I will, buy, I will, I will support each cheese, okay. replica yeah. it trip, yeah, 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 because it's a local brand, as much as I'm a Kaza cheese fan. But. I'm sure just say it. Sabikapa. Oh. Ah, cap and grand. I want it trip. Indian born. My favorite of Amazulu now. All of a sudden, guys, let me read the comments. Um, so says, well done, Mr. Lekau, the Duba Birds support local brands. This is an amazing thing for South African brands. We want to see a soccer boot, says Umpo. Um, I saw why it will be deadly this season. I see them finishing ahead of Chiefs. If the Duba Birds do well this season, I even get a trophy. The marketing will be great. Um, no deckies. They will make money by kit and marketing. Sponsors have clues in contracts, uh, both player and team side. Drip will hit a billion soon in less than four years. Drip boots, now we're getting overexcited. If Max boots don't um, have hype, what about Drip? It takes a lot of money to manufacture quality boots. Hey man. Quality boots, not uh, China boots, not China boots, quality boots. So hope other local brands can support local teams. Um, let's see. Drip was the technical sponsor for Black Eagles. There we go. That's the team. Black Eagles, Northwest ABC. Um, they had 31 players. Good moves in terms of local promotion. Is Drip promising to make boots? I don't think so. But I can, I can read the statement. So the statement from Drip says, um, Drip to be the new technical sponsor for Morocco Swallows. The relationship between Drip and Morocco Swallows in this era is, qu is quite a significant one. Drip is a lifestyle brand that is now confidently spreading its wings and tapping into the world of sports, whereas Swallows is going back to its roots by adopting its original name, Morocco Swallows, and in the process acquiring a new coach and new team players. Both brands are going through a rebirth, and as a result, this partnership was a no-brainer. It is the merging of two brands and the beginning of a great story for both local football and sportswear brands. Welcome to the rebirth. Sorry, guys, my light is, is doing things. Um, but now I want to ask you, is this a case of Sunday Swallows couldn't find another sponsor that was willing to sponsor the team? And so they went for a, a PR angle that would look good. What do you think of that? You mentioned something uh, earlier when you, you, you do an intro. Mostly, the team that normally they get technical sponsor fully. Mm -hmm. You go for Sundowns, Pirates, Chiefs, mm -hmm. and the, this Cape team, uh, mm -hmm. Cape Town, because Cape they can negotiate. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. most of the team, like Amazon, yeah, they got to, you know, if we, most of the team, you know what they are doing, they just buy. It, yeah. Like you and me. At a discount, yeah. They had the discount. You find out, you know, you see, if you still remember T, uh, TTM, the one that it was Vets. Mm, 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 mm. You still remember what Mkhong uh, was wearing Adidas, Adidas, he mix, you know, mix masala. You understand? <laughs> yeah. No, like I will agree with a Chweni. As for me, when I see things, the stage of drip is not yet there mm. to splash a lot of money on sock. Mm, mm, and mm, again, mm, mm. Swallows is an old team for, it's old, for old, old people, Swallows. Mm, mm. Swallows people, they don't buy kids. Mm. I like Chiefs. Mm, if mm, let's mm. say they go to the root of Chiefs, they were going to sell. Maybe they're going to take the, that uh, trend of uh, sneakers because they've got a lot of colors. Maybe mm. Swallows does have started wearing seven colors, maybe. We don't mm, know. Mm. <laughs> and, and again, you mentioned, ask your question, okay, it was the last minute. Mm. Yeah, because it was a last minute because, okay, let's take this guy and give them opportunity to run with it. Mm. And we know, uh, like we now with the receptor, we are supporting a black, you know, local brand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like if we can check, even like Arrows, they don't have a technical response. Are you yeah. aware? Yeah. 
And uh, even like other team from the north, the one of Aroka, mm -hmm. that is a local brand also. To me, but, but can I can I just ask, yeah. why do these teams struggle with that? Because surely it's a PSL team, it's on Super Sport every other day. You might not be able to get a deal that Pirates has or the deal that Chiefs has, but surely, man, kid sponsors should be something that's that's a simple thing to get at this moment. It's not like it's been simple. Like if you, you know what you are drop with, yeah. you understand? Yeah. You mm. cannot allow to be taken for a right. Mm. Remember, let's just take an example. You are team like Morocco Swallows. Yeah. You know when they play with Chiefs on the billboard, home, mm. home game, mm. you will see your brand there is floating around. Yeah. That yeah. means me, I promote your product, but what I get in return? Mm. Nothing. Mm. Because you know that the team that they stick non brand JC, yeah. I'm waiting mm. for them. Because they're not taken for a grant granted. You know, like when you play Chiefs, the, you know, you see like those billboards, the rhino, mm. they, they rotate those drip, you'll see drip, non-stop mm. drip. Mm. How many people mm. that they start to conscious their mind, okay, that this brand. And yeah. now at the same time, on those billboards, you'll see all kinds of sneakers. Mm. Mm. But mm. as a team, what are we getting? Mm. Nothing. Mm. I think, you know, this guy, these guys that they are not using a so-called famous brand, I'm happy for them. Okay. Yeah, so, like, think, you know, like so, you, so, so when you sit back yeah. and look at it, do you think that Swallow's got a good deal? How, how, how different do you see this? Noting that it drip is a smaller brand, it's still new, all of that stuff. Do you think that the deal they gave them would be better than a deal that... Umbro would give you when you're buying on, uh, on on discount. There is something that you know. If we dig this further, mm. it's so a drip. To me, a drip is a winner here. Okay. You know why I'm saying it's a winner? Mm. You see all the road on the billboard. Mm, mm, mm. Now you spend less on the marketing. Yeah. Now you got a free platform mm. where they can start. You know, you just remember. So I can say, you know, it's number four, number five. Most mm. of the, t the games, they show them live on TV. Mm, 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 now, mm, mm. people that they start to notice your brand. Mm. Like when it's a billboard, how many people they drive past that billboard? Mm, 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 now, remember, people that they are watching from SABC, you will able, mm. they are able to see your brand. Mm. Super Sports, they'll see your brand. And if you can see now, all these malls, they are all over the place. Yeah. Now, to, for them... When marketing, it will be easier for them. Mm, 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 mm. To me, the winner here is not Swallows, it's mm. a drip. Mm. Okay. I like that. That I'm going to ask that exact question to Hendrik. Hendrik, I've got the two things for you. Is this a deal of desperation? Was, was, could, could Swallows not get a sponsor and then decided to pull something, number one? Do you think the deal is a good deal for Swallows or do you think it's in line, um, noting the size of, of Drip, do you think it's in line with what they would get anywhere else? And then thirdly, who won this deal? Uh, you see, my brother, I'm going to say something. Man. Uh, okay. I think already, there's no such thing as, I, I don't think there's no such thing, uh, this, uh, such thing as a rush deal. Mm -hmm. You know what I believe? Mm -hmm. I believe mm. this deal was already on the table, okay. but when it was on the table, Swallows looked to see who re, which other sponsors are we receiving. I yeah. do not think who re, it's a rush deal. This is a business. This is a business where Swallows, if they can do one mistake, they could be sued. Like it's a business transaction, you know. Yes, and, uh, yes, yes. Swallows honestly speaking, if now they they have re, they have regained their uh, uh, long ago status, mm. it means now they are that big at club. Understand. Mm, mm, so mm, I think mm, right now this thing has been on the table for a long time. Drip, like guys, let's be honest. Drip is a is a company that reached for the sky from mm, how it was started, from mm, how it's moving. Like like th this company, it's 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 a company filled with uh, people who are enthusiastic. My brother, enthusiastic. Okay. I don't know if that's the that's the drip, that, that's the right word. Like mm, banale that anger. Yeah, mm. the hunger that they have that too much hunger, so mm. they are reaching for the sky. So I don't mm. believe it's it, it was a, it was a rush decision. I believe it was what like, like that's what uh, what was on the table for for okay. Swallows. Okay. Maybe Swallows mm. stayed and they said, "Ori, you know what? 
let's see which other sponsors are coming. Like I said, yeah. and then yeah. Drip came in, and then it was only Drip on the table, and then mm. they decided to take it. Because I think what Solo see when they thought, Ori, we are going back to Morocco Solos, I think they thought, Ori, I sponsors are gonna come piling in. Maybe yeah. VW might come in, you know, stuff yeah. like that. Come back, yeah. That was in the case. So mm. I think Hori, it was yeah. So I think Hori, it was already on the table, but Suarez was looking for other options. Unfortunately, they did not get other options. You understand? Mm, 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 yeah. Mm, mm. And then back to this, I'm agreeing yeah. with uh, my brother Mpo who just spoke. This deal will benefit Drip. So okay. see, I don't think they will ever benefit the Botsanid. Maybe when they when they start making uh, uh, boots, but at mm. the moment it's for drip. Honestly speaking, mm. uh, the mm. marketing that drip uh, will get, like on football, like and you know, drippy. Let's not lie; they produce uh, beautiful things, nice okay. things. You mm. understand? Mm. So mm. imagine those uh, solo supporters uh, being encouraged by their teams to buy those mm. shirts, you mm. know, mm. and then they are beautiful. Most of them. I think Drip will benefit a lot. Mm. They will benefit a lot. That's why they started off with the technical team because they know already the technical team is not a lot of people that we will be designing clothes for. It's just yeah. this, this, the coach, and then that's it. The players are in a large scale, so we won't be uh, designing for them. And then also the fans are in Hi, ah, they're taking over design, all of that. Uh, designing for them. Maybe they're we'll taking over this. all of that. They're taking over the whole all thing. All of that. Yeah. So Drip is going to be the... Are, when it's a technical the sponsor, thing. it's the whole thing. So they are going to be the provider of kits and um, clothing and merchandise for Swallows, the whole Swallows brand. Oh, mm. shakes. Oh, shakes. But no, I thought, uh, you know, I, I was, I, I was, I think I was, I was, um, distracted you know like i oh. thought official sponsor <laughs> meant they, they were gonna cover everything and technical mm-hmm. meant nobody's fine i understand so in mm-hmm. that case my brother drip are gonna make a killing out of this watch the okay. space and they're gonna be supporting uh, 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 swallows for a long time people mm-hmm. must understand that south africa only has how many big sponsors i think we have nike we have adidas and mm. we have Kappa now because obviously Kappa has chips well, so we have Kappa now. so we what other brands do we have we have we, we have Puma. Yeah, mm. keep humor and then what? What again? I think it's only this four. The ones well, that we know on PSL. On PSL, other okay, one? in PSL. Yeah, yeah, it's only this four. People yeah, it's, yeah, it's in PSL. Mm. So mm. it's only, yeah, what, what, Ambro. It's mm. only those four. Here you five. You understand, mm. Ambro. Mm. So imagine if Drip comes in and then there are new teams that will be maybe uh in national first division that will be looking for sponsors maybe to yeah. go there like drip is gonna make a lot of money i'm telling you like what uh, m Paul said he said that uh, they will cut off this thing of billboards and then swallows will be their billboards is 100 percent right the only mm-hmm. one to benefit here is drip whether you like it or not solos is just there to promote drip but a good move because solos decided to get a sponsor playing without a sponsor empty shirts mm-hmm. hey, it's not nice baba you will eat pop with rice but I want to ask you right there. I want to ask you. I want to stop you right there and ask you a question. Why can't PSL teams get sponsors? I mean, we've broken it down. They're on TV most of the time. Their their matches are played there. You've got potential of of maybe billboards and things like that. You've got built-in fan bases, especially now maybe with Morocco Swallows. Why is it that these teams can't go to sponsors and get them? Hey. Fans, baba. I'm a supporter. See. They don't mm. have supporters. Like, um, for instance, what do you benefit now? You know, drip. You know, you know the reason why drip took on uh, Morocco Solos now is they mm. believe that Solos could at least regain half of what they were. You understand? I think okay. that's why drip targeted. I don't believe that they will go back to what they were, but I believe for drip is saw an opportunity. So Solos could actually go back to at least half. Of what they were, mm. so they are trying for that happy ending, you know, sad story and happy ending, you know, like, mm-hmm. uh, like, like. I think they are doing that, but mm. other teams will start, will struggle for sponsors. Number one, because they don't have fans, my brother. Mm-hmm. They don't have fans. Watch when Baroka, watch when Baroka is playing. Uh, 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 Skukun. Have you seen yeah. the stadiums? Disgrace, yeah. Baba. Yeah. Like it's 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 a disgrace. So which team? Which team wants to take? Imagine, imagine, uh, what would Nike uh, uh, benefit from taking Baroga and say or Baroga is our official sponsor? Mm-hmm. Nothing. Mm-hmm. They will only buy a hundred and fifty shirts, mm-hmm. two hundred shirts. You know, so it's not beneficial to them. Other teams, Kappa, 
Chiefs be the benefit. Yeah. <laughs> like Kaiser Chiefs. Like Kaiser Chiefs now. They are bad. But Kappa knows Urbana. This team is just fucking like Mali. People are already gloating about uh, Chiefs' shirt is beautiful. Siabonga, mm. Jessica. It shows. Chiefs' is, uh, Kappa is going to make money. You understand? Mm, 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 so, mm, unfortunately, mm. with the small teams, they are not like other teams, like England teams, you know, like Spanish teams. Those teams have fans. Like, uh, check this team that are, um, just got promoted at England, Luton Town. Yeah. Have you seen how many fans it has? Yeah. A lot of fans. So, as mm. uh, someone going, someone going after that team and so I want to sponsor that team, they will benefit. But mm. with Baroga, what do you benefit? With, with, think, with, with, with other the small teams, what do you benefit? They will still struggle because there's no... Yes. No, no, no. I wanna, I'm going to ask this question to everybody. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stop you there because I want to ask this question okay. to everyone else when we come in. I like that. I like that way we went. Fene, um, was this a desperation deal that Swallows looked at the market and said, guys, nobody's coming to us to sponsor let's do this drip deal let's see how it goes um and then also who's gonna win this deal and then why don't psl why can't psl teams get sponsors um okay i'm gonna answer first your last question as to why psl teams don't get sponsors um sponsors are in this business for revenue right and if if they are not certain or if there's uncertainty or if the stats don't look right in terms mm -hmm. of the revenue they can make or they could make then i don't think it's possible for you to sponsor to sponsor mm -hmm. you another thing is that there's a sponsorship um administration in the PSO. i think that the causa is the head of that yeah you know um and sometimes, yeah, I think they sway sponsors to where they would want sponsors to go. Okay. You know? um, mm -hmm. If you look at what happened with Cape Town City in the past two two seasons, you know, um, in terms of now them having a financial institution sponsoring Yeah, getting them, blocked. You know, mm. it caused them a lot of trouble. Mm. Uh, but at the end of the day, John Comerty was like, nah, I'm not going to, you know, I'm not gonna back off. I'm I'm gonna do what I need to do. Mm. I need the financials and whatnot. Mm -hmm. So what's one of those? Um, I think it's a bit of 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 of, of an experiment by Drip. You know, okay. um, okay. they have market access. They've been given market access, um, by Eagles, mm -hmm. and then Swallows is saying, let's give you guys a bit of a bigger market access. Mm. Now, what they do, Drip already has suppliers in in China you know mm -hmm. or whenever mm -hmm. they're going to be sourcing the stuff because they're not going to manufacture the stuff so what they'll be doing is to source um the kits and whatever mm -hmm. that's going to be needed you know mm -hmm. at, at a reasonable rate rebrand them and give them to soilers yeah um and then uh, they will see how that goes but looking at it also it's it's a business it's a business transaction where you find that um Drip already has set up um, a, a lot of franchises, you know, and that would mean that in terms of tax implications, um, they're feeling it, you know. So mm. what they're going to be doing now, they know that they might not get any return on revenue with the Swallows yeah. deal. Okay. So what they're going to be doing, if they have any debt with, with uh, South African uh, tax revenue, mm. it, it will lower that debt or it would lower whatever they have to pay back to South because they okay. would claim that they've lost the money yeah. through this deal. Yeah, yeah, Soilos, you know. Mm -hmm. Um Soilos, um, I think for them it's it's a bit of a winner because um they did not have a technical sponsor. So what they were doing in the bonnet, they were buying at a lower rate. Yeah. You know, um at, at Umbro. And then what they do they would then rebrand you know the kids and mm, everything mm, 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 you know um mm. so now you might think that if they were spending about 1.2 million on kids mm. uh, per annum mm. um maybe it's gonna go down maybe to about 600 700 000 rand you know um so you might even think that um soilos might be 
the ones even paying for this trip, um, mm. what you call uh, merchandise. Yes. Yeah. Um, because when you say you're a technical sponsor, you also have to put money on the table. I'll make mm. an example with Kappa. Uh, mm. Kappa will be paying cheese a lot of money, you know, mm -hmm. and cheese will be getting royalties per unit sold. You know, mm -hmm. um, Nike, uh, I think I'll, I'll make an example. Let's say Nike was giving chips, um, maybe two percent of royalties. You know, mm -hmm. that is saying to Kaiser Chiefs, let's give you 25 percent, you know, because mm -hmm. we know you have the numbers, mm -hmm. you know. Um, so it's it, it's one of those, but we'll see because now a team like Swellos, Swellos literally is about 200 supporters, <laughs> you know, um, okay. and 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 those 200 supporters. Um, it's it's people that are over the age of thirty five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, they are not um uh, into that street way. I am not even sure that they clued up about about the trip. trip about mm. the trip. Yeah, you know, they were just like, okay, what's this? You know, it's it's old people, man. So mm. what are they trying to sell? Are they saying they're gonna sell um their sneakers to all, to those people or they mm. want to market to those people mm, um, mm, mm, it mm, doesn't mm. really make business sense in terms of return on the investment but um, because these are two businessmen yeah you know, south african businessmen um they're leveraging of each other and now i just hope it works out you know okay. i just don't want the deals that are going to be falling off the cracks mm -hmm. you know and then you're reading stories in the papers or there's headlines you know i just want everything to be smooth sailing you know mm. if the two parties had an agreement let them okay. stick to it okay. and i hope it works out for the good of our, of our game and of the team no i hear you i hear you uh, uh, trying let me bring them some so the same questions for you, man. Was Swallows desperate in making this deal, trying to find somebody because they couldn't get a sponsor? Do you think that um, this is going to be a good deal for them? And then also, why do PSL teams struggle, man? Ngalinda a sponsorship. Okay. Uh, firstly, I don't think this was a rush, rush deal. I okay. think uh, uh, maybe Mr. Kau Swallows earlier, or Kulumanganda by a sponsor, but maybe let's wait for a bigger sponsor or mm. somewhat estuary legal or rest to me, I can put it like that. Mm. Until Singer Valley, then Basalis Bambiza Bambiza is citing with no Siam Far. And then yeah. <clears throat> another thing, maybe if I can just add Nalinda by cheese or not cheese actually, a replica. Mm. I think. Or oh, what I believe, Guti, I trust this guy. Uh, I'm following his story even on mm -hmm. um, on YouTube. I've seen his story. I think he's a great guy. We marketing with uh, mm. a very best uh, replica. Guti, as much as Iswalus is understand, Guti, na ma supporter Zai five or I six maybe. But if it's a ne 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 chiefs or it's a ne pirates, then so ibon so iboni chiefs. Guti, no mm. chiefs li. So much of the pirates very servant if Lily Chiches will definitely buy it because if I can just uh, maybe track back, I, I I don't know if you still remember Nature's Lessel Ticks El Gila Kogu South Africa a must stripe sack green and white. Yeah. I, I yeah. think Bebasa sponsor Shway Repok. Yeah. Not everyone bega support yeah. Celtics. Yeah. yeah, but if we let like his belt go on a corner south of the Ganja. Because we used to buy that cheese even since I see my supporters were Celtics. Mm. So I'm hoping Uti Uzo Naiguzo and Zaganjal again. Mm. Yeah. And another thing, Linda by my sponsors in South Africa. Ash, I, I don't know about it. I made teams Uti and Zagalan. Or maybe they just need their marketing to get their marketing straight because. Uh, if you see, uh, the only sponsors, as, uh, I think it's about uh, uh, I think I'll be four or I five. Mm. Maraguna, my friends, are money in South Africa. I don't know if people, uh, maybe the people in the team are talking, uh, but they just think Google says, I like this TV. born, they will come and approach us. I don't mm. know. Mang uh, Pegaleti, Lesuelos, I think maybe our teams, they are not going out by Guma friends, Guti. Uh, we need something like this, uh, or yeah. maybe we need a sponsorship. Gunin. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Golden Arrows. Sisha Lescati City, we Premier League. 
I think years you they will go to is in their way they will just speak years you golden arrows has been there with PSL Mara I think now basta mm, mm. okay yeah. okay no nyaguza so let me read the comments quickly um it's exciting to see Swallows taking the league serious I wish them all the best um, most Nike and Co make their boots in China um, actually most high end products come from China says Uhausa um this is a match made in heaven, says Senzo. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's see, Drip must just make breath, a breathtaking kit and watch how they will sell out. Uh, this is a good deal, says Hauser. Like you said yesterday, sometimes we, can, we just need to apply our minds in certain issues. Swallows is owned by who? What is the relationship between the owners of the brands? It's a win for both parties, says Usiz. Faraga Koko, thank you so much for the gifts. Um, I'm saying this deal has been in the works for a while. Uh, Swallows doesn't have the target market to make Drip revenues. Um... Fila, yeah, in pop wrote up UE Fila, for example. On a purely business basis, the deal is uh, on the part of Drip makes sense. I think uh, three points. Lekau said that he is not venturing into new things and is focus and is not focusing on shoes. He won this deal. Um, the definition Drip is building, rebuilding very well. Average age of swallows supporters thirty five upwards. The Adora T shirt sponsor. <laughs> uh, leverage Drip um, may make a loss, but they will. Be written off in the company accounts, reducing stars. Um, a friend opening a new market for a new friend. End of story here. Another benefit is using Swallows as the test tube. Uh, it doesn't make sense to try new waters with Big Fish. There's no return on investment um, in the sponsorship of PSL teams. Uh, why it's on for spring box? Again, um, engage niche markets. How are you a sneaker company without being visible in the market? Where the sneakers used again, Drip has been embroiled in a PR nightmare with the owner and the wife's divorce. So this is a good PR move. Uh, you hardly find Solo's T-shirts in any store, which means they'll not benefit. They'll not be the beneficiary uh, of revenue for Drip. Drip actually, um, I believe they joined with uh, Woolworths, if I'm not mistaken. Woolworths is going to. Um, hold a lot of their products. So that might be another way to go. I think Drip is not interested in the t-shirt sales, but selling sneakers, they'll push that side more. Can I ask what matters most? The design of the, of the t-shirt or the brand sponsor? Um, that's a tough question. We can actually, um, I'm going to ask the panel that too. That's a tough question because, I just want to write it down, because sometimes we identify with the maker of the kit more than the team, right? So some of us, We'll never wear Kappa, for example, because we associate with Nike and Adidas and those guys um, who are quote-unquote proper brands, if that makes sense. So there is that side to it. But also, the reason why you'd sponsor in a team sport is because they have built-in, uh, built, they, they're supposed to have built-in supporters. Every year the kit changes and um, how it's meant to work is that every year you buy the new kit, right? So for these guys, you can change all that stuff. But there has been questions around about Nike um, and, and, and those type of brands, the bigger brands. Because really, when you look at what they've been giving us over the past few years and what's been happening in Europe and in other countries, you could say that a lot of the design was lazy to the point where... I remember Chiefs complaining that when they did the anniversary kit, Nike essentially stole that whole idea and started giving it to other people. So there is, it's, it's a tough question to answer, but I'm going to ask the panel um, just now. And then, okay, let me go into the panel. Uh, Brampo, two questions. Uh, uh, Henrik mentioned in Luton, Luton Town. And I think the key to Luton's um, the key to Luton's marketing and the fans is that within a Luton, they're the big team. They make sure they're in the community. They're doing all that stuff. Can we say that these teams, our PSL teams, are not doing enough in order to grow the fan bases outside of what's happening on the pitch? Are they doing enough to grow the fan bases? And then number two, what's the bigger deal? Is it the design of the kit? Or the sponsor on the kit. Where do you weigh in on that one? Okay, uh, I just want like a example. I mentioned Fila and yeah. Drip. They said a deal with Fila, yes, Italian, yes. Italian giant. Yes, meaning that 
swallows they wanna they wanna tap from filler also. Yeah, yeah. And filler, they will design something for the players whatsoever. Mm. That means you know, like you mentioned the question. Remember in South Africa, we don't have a team that's owned by town. Yeah, yeah. Like in England, when they say Manchester, mm. that team is residing in Manchester. Mm. For now, we still have a Notre Cape that doesn't have a, P- a team in PSL. Mm. Mm. You got a, a Northwest that doesn't have a team in PSL. Mm. How many teams are in Houghton? Ah, a lot. Half of them. There's a lot, lot. Mm. Let's example the teams they were in those provinces. That means they uh, those uh, they were gonna benefit. Yeah. And and but again. Then, but then, can mm. I just uh, I just want to ask you. Say for example, Siaziguti. We know that Dimiroka Swallows is um, Dobsonville, or mm. they're close to that place. Shouldn't Swallows be doing more to activate at the very least in Dobsonville, or E Chipa is in um, that municipality in, in the Eastern Cape? Shouldn't they be doing more within that, in, in, at least in that municipality, to say, guys, Naitimienu, here we are. are. Are they just not? Isn't it a case of them just being lazy, man? Remember, as you got a product, you got your own product. Mm. As a community, what are they benefiting from, from that uh, product? Product, mm. the, yes. the, the product. That's what I. I'll yeah, give yeah. you an example. If we, the team, when they name the, the team, they name according to the, their town. Mm. You still remember you used to have a, a Tembisa Classic. Mm, mm, mm. Most of the people of Tembisa, they were thinking now they are part of the team. Yeah. Because his name is associated with them. Okay. Now cheaper. That is my own brand. Mm, if you can mm, say, mm. if you can remember very well, Bluefontein Celtic. Mm. Everyone staying in free state, they know Celtic, Bluefontein. Yeah. yeah. That name mm. is presented them. Mm, 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 mm. Bucks, Everyone's mm. water house, they know that Mutata is a yeah. Mutata team. Yeah. If that team, those guys that they buy team, they start na- naming the team according to the province. When they okay. decide, mm. people they will start going there. Even like when you are wearing blue for the swelling, you feel mm. I'm a swelling. Whatever mm. you are in the province, okay. That's the thing. Like these marketing people, they are missing that point. Mm. That's that. You know, like if they can use that route, I'm telling you, they will definitely, you know, get you, you know, a sponsor because you know, okay, over the weekend our team is playing. You know, yeah. when I'm wearing, you know. Masogolara, in the Sogolara yeah. streets. Mm, People mm, like Toto mm. Stars, Toto. You know that mm. team, it was built to Toto. Mm, mm, mm. This, this name of naming uh, teams with the names of the you know owners, is mm. the one that okay, that is your team. Like mm. the Kaiser Chiefs, you understand? Like the Kaiser Chiefs, where did it is, they used to uh, want to get players that they can pull the crowds. Yeah. If the Chiefs, it was then like it, it, the, that means what I can say, chiefs. It was built in a good foundation. The only way when we grow up, the only chief that comes to my mind is was chiefs' parents. Mm. And after the sundowns, mm, now mm, if you mm. can check the younger ones, 16, mm. 17 years, they're mm. associating with what sundowns mm. because they were associated the same with the winning team. Yeah, now the only people that they're supporting chiefs and pirates is us older ones who mm, watch the mm, doctors, mm. listen to Elaine, those, mm. yeah. Mm-hmm. That topic from now check sundowns who supports sundowns now the youth mm. because they okay. want to associate themselves what winning team. Mm. But you see, like for example, sundowns does heavy outreach. Cabo Mamilodi, go at Ridgeville, they do heavy outreach. But you see the other teams not doing that. But then I just want to ask you, what's more important? Um, just to go back to the question asked in the comments, what's more important? Is it the brand sponsor or is it the design of the kit for you? Depend on what uh, angle are you coming from. Mm. As you have a brand, you are clothing brand. Mm. Technical sponsor is, is the way to go. Mm. Like if I have, you know, I've got my own company. So to be visible, I'll buy a space to put my cup on this, you know, yeah. on the shirt of the team. Yeah. Mm. Now, if you like now drip, they are going to uh, swallows. Now, their design part department, they can able to play with the design. They say can make a, a warm up a t-shirt. Now mm. they can mm. able to take to their shop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it, that's the, you know, that 
That way you can able to win. Remember mm. now, you keep catching a drink. I'm telling you, oh, you're gonna have a slot for protein now and drink. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Because it was only shoes. You know, you'll see they're gonna start having a socks. Yeah. Short. Mm. Underway. You understand? Now mm. th- now you are business now is expanding. It's no longer mm. only sneakers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Like I'm no. saying, the one that's mm. gonna benefit the whole deal is yeah. Rick. <laughs> no, I hear you. Let me bring it to Hendrik. Hendrik, same same questions for you. We you brought up uh, uh, Luton. Isn't the power of Luton that within whatever community they're in, they've made themselves part of part and parcel of that community all the way, um, even benefiting the community in some ways. Is it not a situation that? these teams can't generate fans or get fans because they're also not doing the work in order to get fans on board. And then, um, simple question from the top, from the comments, what's more important, the brand or the design? Uh, well, I'm a brother, um, like it's, it's like that. Uh, it's like that. If you can, you know, I normally use, um, England as an example, but Spain, they do it. And also even in other leagues, they do it. Yeah. It's about yeah. what the, 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 the team, like the foundation of the team is about. Mm. Uh, like, check this. Let me give you an example. You have Manchester United. There's Manchester. You have Manchester City. There's Manchester. You have Liverpool. There's Liverpool. You have Sheffield. There's Sheffield. You get mm. the truth. You have mm. Brentford. There's Brentford. Mm. And then people don't know that in, in, in Europe, ne, this uh, fan base, like there, there is a small percentage that fan uh, the fans they own. Like it may be 2%, uh, okay. 3%, but there is a small percentage for the fans. That's why uh, there was this, this, this club that almost went bankrupt. And then the fans contributed, man. I think it, it's in Germany. Just check the story. I think it's in yeah, Germany. Yeah, yeah. I forgot yeah. the team. And mm-hmm. then, uh, yeah, yes. So that team, the uh, fans contributed because why? That team was named after the town. Mm. And then it was a team that was that, like, they, they normally took decisions uh, based on like that they would uh, gather fans, you know, take the decisions and understand what fans feel about this sort of decisions. And it's also happening with this team, uh, Rexham. You see, yeah, Rexham, uh, yeah, yeah, that yeah. team, have you seen uh, for our, uh, uh, yes, Rexham, the one with Ryan Reynolds. You mm. see how the owners and the club is interacting with the fans. Mm. That's how our South African teams should be like. This mm. thing of renaming teams with but I'm very jealous because Rabolel. Because name you, you can't name a team Royal and Dilem Pisani. What the hell is that? It's it's Chiefs got lucky for me. Like for me, Kaza Chiefs, uh, they got lucky by uh, the, the 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 owner of the club as, as as the name of the club. They got lucky. Like, but mm. these teams are gonna suffer now. They must start mm. renaming their teams like where they come from. They will see the support. We saw it with um uh, uh, this place, what uh, this team, and uh, the one Yabatu Wapela ninety minutes with him man. Um, Celtic. It, it was sponsored by yes, yes, that team. So we saw it by Celtic, man. Celtic had a big, a big, big, big fan base. I remember Sundowns playing at 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 at, at Blue Fontaine, mm. eh, where they got I think it's four or three guys, three nil. Like the fan base was huge. Mm. People were singing for ninety minutes. That's mm. the power of renaming uh, your team based on its location. That's the only mm. way that uh, South African teams can get but the sponsors. Because but, but, let's say... Let, mm, mm, no, no, no. Go ahead. Go ahead. Sorry. Go ahead. Yes. Yes. Like, 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 like for instance, have you ever gloated about something that you have and other people don't have? Man, mm. have you seen my team, Imar? Ah, oh, my team is playing beautiful football. That's what supporters need. Mm, mm, That's mm. what they need. They need something to, to, to make them connect with the team. That comes from their area. Like mm. for instance, uh, let me say Baroga. There's there's no place that's called Baroga. People mm. are, are having Kaiser Chiefs there majority of the time. Buying mm. Kaiser Chiefs shares, they are not buying Baroga shares. Why? Because it doesn't interact with them. Rename it uh, 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 a place, like rename it from a place that's there. Rename it from a location. I'm telling you, you're going to get the support. Rename it with a giant name. Like let's say for example, uh, like I, 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 I'm blind. I don't. Th- I can't think of something. But okay. use a, a a township or or a place to 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 rebrand your team, my brother. I'm telling you, you will win always. The supporters every time when you're playing against Kaiser Chiefs, they will say Limpopo versus Kaiser Chiefs. They will say Houghton versus what what. They will say that's how it will go. Mm. You must have uh, uh, the the support of your 
of 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 your people where you come from as a team. Mm. And but then, then can't that can't that team, be uh, can't, can't, and, can't, can't that be also just like what I remember from the PSL back then, right? Was community management, PROs, the 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 ticket, all those things. They made sure that they were reaching out to everyone. Like they made sure if you're in Bloemfontein, Celtic was going to touch you at some point. Not to when you go look for it, or even if you don't watch the matches or whatever. Isn't it a case where the teams themselves? Because in any case, we know that he, Richards Bay plays in a specific stadium. We know that he, 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 he cheaper plays in a specific stadium in a specific municipality. But are they doing enough to make sure that those fans are part of Ichipa? Or are they expecting just because Chipa's there, now fans must jump on? Because I, I remember with Chiefs, we don't have membership, King membership cards anymore. Remember, that we used to have a huge membership thing, right? Aren't those things also playing a role a in not being able to get fans on board? Yeah, they are, they are playing a role, ne? Um, but the membership one, let's say, for example, if a team tries it and then that team, it's only sundowns because it's, it's the only dominating team. Even if Chiefs mm. tries to for membership thing, now it's failed. So let's try from another angle. I think what these teams must interact in their team, in, in, with their fans in, in, in another way. Have mm. you seen with, with Kaiser Chiefs, they would normally host uh, uh, the, uh, this charity event. You know, I mm. remember there was this on Kaiser Chiefs TV when... Uh, the, the the entire squad went in Soweto to visit this old go go. You know they gave her t-shirts. You know, yeah, like yeah. they need to do more things like that. You know, like mm, mm, like mm. sometimes find the players maybe go into tournaments watching the young the young not just that's one what, yeah, player. Exactly, no, that's what I'm saying. Finding yeah. like the whole yes yeah yeah like 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 finding the whole team supporting a tournament that was hosted by maybe Sheikhs or hosted by me. It gives them, you know, motivate those players at least care for us. Like, interact with the community. Do a soup kitchen. Like, do something like that. Mm. Interact, interact. It's not going to cost a lot of money. Interact mm. with, 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 your, you, with your fans. I'm telling you, when you go back, my brother, you will have your entire township behind you. But now mm. you don't interact. You just yeah. sit there. Your players don't even take pictures, most of them. Like, the players are not swing, bra. Like, mm. South African mm. players, they swing or Cristiano Ronaldo yes. and Messi. Yes. Like they, they swank and most of them are rude. Mm. Like, how are you gonna support something like this? You have mm. you have owners like Abu Bobi. Bobby's lucky because of Kaiser Chiefs was built without him. You have Abu Abu owners like Abu Chipam Pengues doesn't listen to his fans. Yes. Like they are rude, obnoxious, but mm. they, uh, they can't do anything. So unfortunately they will never get sponsors. Mm. I remember with this uh, fair, uh this this owner of of, of um uh, Black Leopard. He said something, and then it, it, it did not sit well with the fans. He did not care about their feelings. Yes, he did not do. He did not do anything about it. Did not even apologize. You see, mm. they are rude and obnoxious. They don't care about their fans. They don't even do something like a soup kitchen. Do a soup kitchen for the homeless. Mm. You know, mm. go in there and then the the old used jerseys, the one that you don't use anymore. Mm. Give it to a small teams. You mm. understand? Give mm. it to the needy. Do you, buy a couple of blankets. Go to shelters. Yeah. Give yeah. it there. Go to the disabled kids where that can't play football. Let mm. the players play with them. But they mm. You understand? Mm. That's mm. how you must interact with the community. Kaiser Chiefs, I think, I think it was last year. I think Kaiser Chiefs did it last year. Uh, but it was Chiefs and Pirates. I think that one, but it was hosted by Vodacom. Yeah, it was yeah, Chiefs yeah. and Pirates. It was last year or last of last year? Mm. Somewhere there. Yes, it was hosted by Vodacom. So do something like that, my brother. If you do something like that, you're going to get the fans at, uh, uh, at your side. Yeah. Give them the shirts, the old shirts that belong to all players for free. Mm. My brother, I'm telling you, mm. they will benefit. And then I'm telling you, already, these teams will benefit a lot. They will have their supporters, but now they don't care. They are rude. They are owners. They don't care about supporters. Yeah. Whether the supporters say, "Oti, sfuna le play ale as fun uskwa muskwa muzo uzo 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 give le bomba ngama la lapa abafuni." They don't care. They will buy uskwa ama ever tenga uskwa. They don't care about the players' uh, the, 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 the defense opinion. You understand? Mm. Yeah, that's about it. Okay. And then with this thing of with this design thing of, or brand sponsor, with this thing mm. of the brand and. Yes, uh, uh, both, 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 like, 
like you can't separate the two baba like both like like for instance what for a cheap uh, for a team like 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 swallows for me they don't have the 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 the, the, the fan base like they used to yeah. So it's supposed to be about the design. But mm. like they're gonna women are gonna come and they're gonna they're gonna buy that shirt if it's beautiful. Women literally buy anything. Now I see ladies from my town here yeah, buying a shirt of 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 a team that's not existing anymore, like yeah. not performing anymore because it's beautiful. But then as women are there are gonna buy it. Especially when it's at Woolworth. Someone is gonna do a review. Guys, I decided to buy this solo shirt. They're gonna do those things. So on yes, <laughs> on yeah, it's up to Drip to lose it. Drip must make sure how they design. <laughs> so up to here, it's up to uh, for for Drip to decide it. It's up, to, <laughs> it's up to Drip to decide it and put it in a in a lovely manner, like design a watch shirt. I'm telling you, we might not buy it because we favor Kaiser Chiefs, but about Faziba Corner Boat, they are gonna do mm. reviews about it. There are ladies there that like nice things, especially when someone said oh, they've signed a deal or something with Woolworth. I think it's you. Mm. They've signed a deal or something with Woolworth. But when the ladies like Woolworth, they will definitely go there. So don't worry about the margin and a drip. The, the owner of Drip Kimu is a person of women. So women will be there. They will buy that shirt. Don't worry. Even okay. I'm I'm sure even at Shin, this hey, shirt me... will be available. Don't worry, Wena. <laughs> Let me bring you to house, man. Also, welcome to the show, my brother. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm good, my man. And you? No, I'm good. I'm good. Firstly, I'm gonna ask you quickly to your thoughts about this this thing before I ask you the two questions. Uh, okay, my my general uh, appeal, the way I see this, this is a wonderful deal, you know. Uh, besides everything that's, that has been mentioned, mm. I would like to offer a new perspective. Okay. Uh, you look at African clubs, you know, in other leagues, you know, mm. getting sponsorship is a, is difficult. Mm. We, we, we can't run away from that. It's very mm. difficult to get a sponsorship, especially mm. in Africa. You know, mm. you look at the PSL, you, the, 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 the teams are looking at, okay, how how high or how how low are these leagues ranking in terms okay. of uh, the rankings on FIFA and the, the the screen time they get all those things you know the the, the sponsors are profit driven mm. so most African teams that are on uh, Swallows' level you know okay. you go to Zimbabwe you go to Malawi you go to Nigeria and all those countries you will see that their sponsor uh, their, their, their their technical sponsors are local businesses okay you know uh, some but not sometimes it's very local but sometimes it's national in their, mm -hmm. the, the, the the biggest brand in their in their country you know mm -hmm. so this deal is, is 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 good in that sense because if 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 Morocco Solos grows triple also grow you know mm -hmm. because as you guys are talking about sales share getting shed sales and all those things so in terms of a uh, making our league more competitive it might not be as a lot of money you know they will that that, that uh, swallows will get from drip you know mm -hmm. but then that that leg up that can says okay i can at least afford one two and three you know okay uh, it's better than no man which is mm -hmm. what i saw with uh, the, the the clubs in i'm looking at uh, a couple of clubs in nigeria mm -hmm. their sponsors are not major international sponsors mm. it's local uh, sponsors owned by a businessman in nigeria who has x amount of uh, his net worth is something in the millions mm -hmm. you know so okay. what i'm looking at is that this is a good move this is actually how many countries are moving if they mm. cannot get sponsorship from the big uh, the big companies they go for the small companies you know so clearly this is a general practice in the african continent so mm. it's a wonderful deal for both teams now I want to ask you the two questions that I asked now. Are these teams doing enough to get fans on board with the teams in order for them to convince these sponsors to come in? Because for me, I don't know, I've said it a few times, but it feels as though they're lazy about their marketing, about their fans, about things like that. What, what do you think of that? Uh, you, you, you are right, you know, because... They themselves see no value in the PSL. They see no value in themselves, to be honest. Mm. If you want somebody to support you, what what's the first? It's a general rule that you must first brag about yourself before somebody comes to you. Okay. We know that. So these teams come up out of nowhere. Look at the Royal EM. Let's mm. talk about a new club. You know, mm -hmm. Royal EM. They came. They have a loud uh, a loud owner. 
who's very uh, what's this who's very present on social media you know yeah. so that's how they got the attention of people mm. but then after that when have you ever heard somebody say oh i was at a royal em activation mm. they do not care about the, the the supporters i'm gonna just put it bluntly you know, you, mm-hmm. we, we might have other reasons, uh, for a technical reason, like, no, there's no man. But then, guys, no. If at least they cannot see you in one community, and then we say that ah, these guys are going to go, no, they are not. Mm-hmm. We're going to continue to support Kaiser Chiefs, even though I'm from Bloemfontein. Mm-hmm. You know, so th- th- there's no there's no passion from these people. Mm-hmm. You know? Marketing mm-hmm. is just a small bit that can mm-hmm. make you, that can give you uh, 200% returns yeah. by just going to a a small group of people and saying this is who we are and what we do. Those people are, are, are there's no there's no limit to how many supporters you can have. Mm. You know, mm. one supporter is one. It, it's a lot. You know, mm. the more you gain people, these people manage. The the way they do, they go about running their clubs. It's very questionable. You know. Yeah. That yeah. We should we should start now intro, introducing Milao. That they are gonna are gonna shake them. You know, in that mm. sense, not only that. Uh, how are you affording this club? But then again, what are you doing with this club? Mm, mm, well, EM mm, is mm, gonna mm. die, and then we're gonna forget about it in five years. We're gonna yeah. oh, yeah, mm, that's a terrible way to remember something. Mm, mm, that's a terrible mm, mm, way to remember something. Mm, mm, something. Mm, so we need, they need to be pushed mm, into doing these things because clearly them doing it on their own, they don't wanna do it. Mm, so they need mm, to be pushed into doing it. Okay, no, yeah. I hear you, I hear you. Uh, Agent 007 SA, welcome to the show, my brother. How are you doing? I'm good, I'm good, my, my guy. How are you? I can't say before Cobalt One now, because Dambi, I don't know where you are now today. <laughs> um, I, I'm, I'm in the capital city of SA today. <laughs> <laughs> no, I hear you. How you feel to me? Um, I yeah. want to ask you first your general thoughts about this um, sponsorship yet trip to Swallows. Well, all right. Um, let me read. Uh, today I feel like I feel young today. Eh? I'm in the presence <laughs> yeah. of old heads. I see uh, Ronya, I see House, I see Henry Guy, man. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Let me just clear this up. Uh, I'm 23, ne? I'm not an old head. I'm 23 years. Uh, no, I mean, you, in terms of. You're 23 uh, and a half. In terms of. of you're 23 and a half. <laughs> 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 no, um, no, go, go on, uh, yes. agent. <laughs> um, I think, I think, like you said, um, well, like I said in the comments, it's a good deal. Um, <clears throat> let me start from the financial sense. Um, okay. If we remember, Drip, is it two years back? Yeah, I think two years back, they signed a hundred mil deal with Casper. Mm. Uh, I don't know if you remember the stay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. yeah, yeah. So it looks like that strategy failed, you know, because it looks like they couldn't tap the market they wanted. Okay. So I think now is a change of strategy, you know. Mm. Um, like I said, it doesn't make sense that <clears throat> you are a footwear, uh, a sneaker footwear, sports footwear, and you don't see your visibility, you know, it doesn't mm. add up. So I think this is a good deal for them. Okay. And also, on the balance sheet, if you go to the balance sheet now, um, <clears throat> sometimes people are trying to, you know, um, I hope I'm not, I'm not exposing them, but um, people try to get around. We that. must also know. We must also, we want to know, Nadi. <laughs> no, um, people try to go out on SARS, um, high bill, you know. Mm. Um, and one way of doing that is to get in such kind of deals, you know. Um, obviously, I think like the panel is seeing, that definitely gonna make a loss, you know? Mm. And that bo- that loss can be returned off in the account, you know, and reducing the tax money they pay, you know? Okay. And on top of that, you know, it's not just a loss in the sense of money, but it's also a profit because from that you've gained free advertising, like some some member mentioned, free exposure, free everything, you know? Mm. So it's a it's a good deal, you know? And Drip has been in the headlines again for, for all the wrong reasons, you know. Mm-hmm. Um, like I said, um, there's been a messy split between the owner and the wife. So I think mm-hmm. this is just good PR. Let, let's be seen in the bright light. You're having a new beginning, like Solos is having a new beginning. So mm-hmm. it's a good thing, you know. And um, yeah, I, I think it's okay. a good deal, yeah. And then let me ask you the question then. 
are these teams doing enough to attract fans? I think we, we, we've, we've spoken about how one of the things that's handicapping teams is that they don't have fans enough in order to convince the sponsors to do something. But my question then becomes, are they doing enough themselves in order to make sure that the fans have something, man, in the team? Um, I think, let me start with um, the big three. Um, the big two um, are suffering from what you call uh, the legacy curse. Okay. They know, uh, you know Paris and Chiefs, even in the next 10 years, I assume, they'll still be the biggest top two um, brands, you know? Mm-hmm. So they don't care about you guys, you know, whether you guys are coming or not, just a family yeah. business. <laughs> you know, they don't care. Mm-hmm. Um, then the others, I feel like that's where they should be taking leave from sundowns, you know? Mm-hmm. Look at sundowns activations, they always mm-hmm. move around universities, they're always yes. in the money loyalty, you know? Muda, and, Daniel Muda was always everywhere. Yeah, you know, and, the community um, manager this, or something like that. Mm. Yeah, and this guy, um, what is his name? Um, Mabunda, you know, Mabunda is always yeah, yes. friends, you mm, know, mm, mm, and mm. so sometimes it's, it's, it's a trail present that, and I hope other I hope other teams could you know follow the track, you know, so that I mean, if I'm from Free State, um, I might support Sundowns, but because I, I'm from Free State. I would want Free State stars to do well, you yeah, know. Yeah. So there is that attachment to a Free State club. There is that attachment from to a Cape Town club if you are from Cape Town, you know. Mm-hmm. So I think it's the the teams are dropping the bar. Um, okay. But what can they do, you know? Um, again, also, I don't think teams as a whole are doing enough to attract fans, you know. Mm-hmm. Um, Cape Town City um, are the only club um, which have uh, uh, what do you call it? A season ticket. Okay. Other clubs have it. You know, imagine as I'm a lawyer, and down support every game I'm there. You know, if I get a season ticket, you know, I mean, five hundred bucks. I mm. mean, it's, it's gonna increase sponsorship because I know I'll be saving. Yeah. You know? Yeah. And so, you're gonna go to all of the games. Yes. As well. mm. You know. And I, I read a statistic uh, last night that Man United um, that ticket, some people are waiting 10 years for it, you know? Yes. So you can imagine. Yeah. yeah. So I think... Okay. Yes. And, and to your question again, I think brand means more than team, you know? Mm-hmm. I won't, I doubt all of a sudden Chief Sales will start wearing Kappa clothes, you know, unless it's a Kappa t-shirt with chiefs logo on it you know mm-hmm. but otherwise i don't see them going all of a sudden i'm from nike and puma and adidas to um to cap i don't think so. yeah okay yes sir. Hey, I, I, must, I, I, I hope yeah. i hope you'll reconnect me I, I have to go a bit somewhere two seconds i hope you'll connect me reconnect me okay well i'm gonna i'm gonna it's, it's a short show today we're gonna end it up past oh, nine so okay yeah no, no cheers man and <laughs> okay. for the others then good night cheers good night good night good night thanks so much uh agent Maronza, super sub, already. Uoma pile. Hey, uoma pile. Kita uza mazama. You know, just number ten at the bench all the time. <laughs> okay, na kari last minute. Oh, the last last minute. No, I was, so, I was on. I was on the comments. I was on the comments. <laughs> I was listening all the time. So I want to ask you, Rodi. Firstly, what are your general thoughts about this trip and Morocco Swallows deal? Um. You know what, as a, as a South African brand, yes, you understand me, but um, I expected more from Swellos, you know, mm-hmm. especially mm-hmm. after changing the name from from uh, Solos FC. From Bin Ben, yes, you know, Bin Ben and all those things. And then now they have that um, opportunity to change the name back to, to the glory days and all that, or the mm-hmm. name, the original name, right? Mm-hmm. I was expecting more from them. You understand mm-hmm. me? Mm-hmm. I think the, the name itself is supposed to, 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 to pull up sponsors for them and all that. You understand me? So I think there is, this is like um, a last minute thing. Okay. They were expecting to get something. But they never got it, so they, they they didn't have any opportunity. But other other opportunities, but this one came, and then they had to take it. But mm-hmm. I, I, feel, I feel this this 
it's just it's just a normal brain man ordinary brain you know mm. like um you even even i'm not saying as, as as south africans right we have to support support them but there's those sneakers when you look at them and say Mara, you understand me it is <laughs> it's just an ordinary anybody can do it it's like you, I, I'm, I'm not i'm not i'm not against it Mm. Some of the some of the brands some some of the the sneakers are very 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 good the good looking mm, but mm, mm, when you, some of the men icon you can see that this this is an ordinary sneaker yeah. you understand me yeah. so, so think about it so I was going into the field of play with the sneaker yes maybe they'll give them the best one for them to 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 wear when they're going to the games and all that you understand mm, me mm, but mm. I feel I feel I feel in South Africa there are so many things man you might think you might think uh. This is just a sponsor, but behind the closed doors, there's something happening. Mm. South Africa, you're very corrupt. You, you don't know. You don't know. There's big names in in Silos. We don't know what is happening. Yeah, I'm telling yeah. you. But anyway, yeah. let me let me not go there for now. But there's so many things which are happening in South Africa. That that is my take. But this is an ordinary sponsor. Is is supposed not to be called like a sponsor, like. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. A, they should be. Yeah. They should be like a shoe sponsor or what they do with the yeah, other deals. Something like that. Not, mm. not, not, not a sponsor. Like if, 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 if they're going for a handy, you understand me. Now we're mm-hmm, talking. Mm-hmm, in mm-hmm. BW, now we're talking. Mm. But we cannot talk of. Come on. Ah, can I pop you late these oh. times? Yo. Can I pop you? Okay, no, it's fine. Let me read the comments. Um, we'll come back to you, Ronnie. Uh, let's see. Uh, PSL teams have sought out their marketing in God to promote their team merch. Um, design Nike has been lazy with designers. Drip and filler deal is over. Chipper gets money from the municipality. Marisburg was paid 12 million a year by the municipality. Marketing team Yeswalos, uh, Ba Vilapa, uh, Uglumitkaniso, Kulmitkaniso, Umpo, uh, like Uppington City Rise, Northern Cape Rise. But then who to support the big teams? I think Design Powerful, when there was a jersey, South America had an America, America content design, uh, continent design. People won't be interested in the PSL since the status of teams is sold. Um, I can't participate because of load shedding. Unlucky King Tefu. But most of these teams are working at a loss, to be honest. It's where the arrogance comes in. I got the GOAT jersey, Atletico Minero, America Continent. I would break the bank for it. Northern Cape, Northwest, Free State teams will never get those big sponsorships. I concur teams are lazy and there is no transparency. Siwelele was doing good with uh, mini fans with no sponsor. Kamo Chomo Cosmo Sili Pizzi, Convela with Puma. Um, teams do not do justice when it comes to marketing. Uh, it's a legacy curse, says Hauser. From the new signings to the new kits, it's all mediocre advertising, says Usenz. Or, um, Chiefs also sell season tickets. All of the big three sell season tickets. It's difficult for the teams because fans don't buy jerseys, especially if it's not the big three. If you buy tickets to watch the teams, they must give you a discount for the jersey. Um, this is a big step. Let's give them a chance to fail. If they fail, let's see what happens. Ronnie, are you back? I'm back. I'm back. Sorry, man. I'm back. Yeah. Um, yeah. I think I was done with that, with that one. Do you have the next question, right? The, the question was... Are these are these teams doing enough to attract fans to them? Like I hear people saying jerseys are not being bought, stadiums are not being filled, but are these teams doing enough outreach and 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 going out into their communities in order for them the, to get the fans on board? The, the, you, you know what, right? Um, I don't think they're doing enough. You know, the, this thing. Um, I think somebody talked about it. It's all it's all about like. Um, they don't have a marketing strategy, most mm. of them. You understand mm, me? Mm, mm, mm. Let me show you an example. Mom kids, yeah. how can you bring Abu Abu Somizi? you thinking that we'll go to the stadium to see Somizi. Come mm, on, man. Mm, 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 and and bring nice cars and all those things, fancy cars. Mm. Then you want us to come and see you in a fancy car. What is what is that? You understand mm. me? Mm. Uh, that, is, that is not marketing. Marketing, it is all about giving back to the community. That's the first thing first. You understand yeah. me? You have to yeah. give back as a team. You have to give it back. We cannot come to the stadium to watch you play all the time, but we mm. don't see you at the community. Yes. We don't see you. And then how do you expect me to come and watch you all the time? Pay 40 rand, 50 rand to come and watch you, but you don't come to me. You understand mm. me? Mm. That is the mm. first thing first. Like mm. look at uh, Cape Town City. Mm. Uh, Cape Town City, when they're playing in, in, in Jobek, 
right? They're sponsored by FNB, right? Yeah. They'll go to Maponya, right? That 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 is that is what they have to do. They have to yeah. go to different malls and all those things, and okay. then they give free tickets and all those things because they're playing where in mm. in in so or anywhere they where they are going. They have to do that mm. as as a team. Mm. That, that that is FNB marketing and even uh, what is Capital Cities marketing for themselves. You understand yeah, me? Yeah, but yeah. what I'm trying to say is teams need to to give back to the community. You cannot open like some of the some some of the things you watch uh, kids achieve TV. They'll go to an old old age home once, then yeah. you disappear. Mm, you understand mm, me? Mm, Just mm, one, mm, then they disappear. Mm, you understand me? Mm. As as players, we need to see you going mm. around you understand me if mm. if chief is playing pirates in soweto why can't you do a, a bus tour in soweto why can't you yes. do that yes yes why can't you do that mm. because th- that is you coming to us and then now we we want we are interested to see how and if if there's there's something happening a gas and all those things why can't you con- come and contribute you understand me yeah yeah another thing that they are doing the wrong right uh within the branches we don't have the pros that we used to have yes yeah. at, at, at that level the, the pros now they um, are what's up um, groups and all those things mm-hmm. they, they don't attend they, we don't have like i'm, a, I'm a, like uh, we used to have like going to the wall as as a branch and all those things yes branches now they're doing it for themselves coming yeah. there sit there and then talk where's the pro yeah yeah where, well, even where, just club is, representatives where? in general Yes, where, where, when do they come? Mm. Like bringing one player or two players to a meeting, what is why why do you, why are they failing to do that? Yeah, yeah. I hope yeah. you understand me. Yeah, so market marketing is all about that coming to coming to recruit. Even even supporters, you have to recruit as much as mm. as we we come in to watch you at the game. But mm. you have to recruit us. You mm, understand? Mm, you mm, the jerseys. You have to recruit us. You have to 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 have nice jerseys. You cannot have the whatever pirates now. The if chiefs and pirates, whatever they've designed, and then you see you're recruiting us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You understand me? So they have to give back to the community. They have mm. to 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 travel. They have to. We have to see them. We cannot see you on on a golf seven all the time. Yeah. Then plate. What is that? We 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 only see you by then passing and all that. We never yeah, see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You mm. understand me? Mm. That is my take on this, man. I just want to add my take before I ask for the for the closing statements. I, I think the thing is, all these things go hand in hand. And we've had this conversation a lot um, on, on this show where it's, I feel as though the teams have taken themselves away from the people. So they're no longer our teams. Like I remember when my father, my father used to speak about Ikeza um, Chiefs and he'd tell you, you'd see him come around before matches, stuff like that. You used to feel part of whatever you were watching. Now, go, 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 Kasi. You may never see those guys ever, let alone the teams. You may never even see the players, right? Back when I was growing up and we were playing football and we had, um, we had tournaments, all the tournaments, there used to be Chief Scouts, you used to see Abu Abu Sporomangena, you used to see Abu Zbanban. It used to be a mess of players, of team representatives, of all of that stuff. In order for them to make them to make us feel like we are part of the team. I don't feel like I'm part of a lot of the other teams. I watch them on TV. It's the same as me supporting Arsenal. I support Arsenal. It's the same. The distance is as far for example, because we no longer have those outreaches. We no longer have opportunities to to interact with the team. Like Ronnie's saying about branches, about memberships, about things like that. You used to be able to know, okay, at least, as Mang Petelik had, I know, Guti, every couple of months, Bazoza and we'll have a thing. I, 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 I point to Sundowns. Somebody spoke about Sundowns and how they go all over the varsities. I was at, vars- at, at my previous varsity. Um, a few months ago, and I walked into the I walked into the the the, the student center, and Daniel Mida was sitting right there with the student branch of Sundowns, and I was like, "Hi, man, I don't see this with Chiefs, I don't see this with Pirates, I don't see this with so many people, you know. Let alone that, everybody knows you play in this stadium. You can create opportunities. 
there's food that needs to be sold. Why not go into the local community and say, hi, guys, Zoralan, come sell at, my, at, the, at the stadium. Hey, guys, you guys sell this. Zoralan, do this. We'll help you do this. We'll help you do that. We'll have some of the players come out. We'll do this. Arsenal, for example, had a whole media campaign where literally businesses around um, North London, where they are, they had adverts for them. So it was uh, Billy's Fish and Chips. We're going to bring, I don't know, uh, Odegaard. And Odegaard is going to do an advert for you. And we're going to put the advert on our social medias in order to get you people. It's small things that you can do in order to get fans on your side. But if you're not going to do those things, you can't expect fans to just magically want to go there and want to do all of those things and want to support the team. We spoke earlier about Plumfontein Celtic. Plumfontein Celtic had an incredible connection with their fans. Incredible connection. There was a time when Chiefs went to go play at Vodacom Park and we were over, we, we were overrun. It was the first time I'd ever seen Kaiser Chiefs overrun in a stadium. But there was connection. There's no longer connection anymore. Abo Vinaba Twitter every now and then. Abo Banbani, they host spaces maybe every once in a while. But in terms of the team feeling close to you, you don't get it. But then also, when you look later on, now you, you come in later on, now they're saying I must go buy the kit. Why am I going to go buy a Richard Bay kit when I don't see Richard Bay come to me? Why am I going to go buy anybody else's kit? Do I even know about the kids? Do I know what they look like outside of when I see them on Supersport, for example? It's it's little things like that. Oh, Ngoto, you've come in right at the end, actually. Sorry about that, my brother. Let me check on Facebook. I've just neglected them a little bit. Let me read what's happening on Facebook. Um, hey, let me just move this out the way. Let's see. It looks like Panyaza Lusuf is processing tenders nice and quick for the two birds. No wonder, Joe. <laughs> I guess I'm not going to get into the politics. Joe, we have been uh, hungry and patiently waiting for a show. I prefer watching on Facebook, but I can comment essays without TikTok characters restriction. Um, 2010 feel it is here. How about you? <laughs> Thank you, Raymond. Um, I saw this one coming, Mr. Then I see it's a difficult season for Sundowns. Other clubs are beefing up their squad. Morocco Solo should add Matoa, Kapinga, and Ralani. Tamai says desperation swallows took this sponsor because they had no option. Uh, can we please discuss PSL players moving to the MLS? We had a chat about this yesterday. I can bring it up again tomorrow and we can speak about it then, um, Raymond. So I think I'm going to. I'm going to see if tomorrow just, just come in with the same um, energy. Then we'll speak about it then. Um, Enric, closing statements for tonight, my brother. My brother, Drip have, as they, they've got a lot of uh, work to do. Now I suggest hey, they should hire me. Well, I suggest, Hori, the first thing that they should do is sure. go on TikTok. CV, boy? Search, why are you laughing? Oh, wait, oh, wait, I'm on. Well, one thing, one, one, one thing that I know, and, uh, one thing I, that that I know, and they don't, don't admit, social media, most especially TikTok, is 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 a platform a platform for you to use if you want to blow up. Now, this is what I think Drip should do. You see yourself, ne? Mm -hmm. and then people that do other soccer uh, uh, content in South Africa, mm -hmm. ne? and also the famous the, 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 the famous content creators who do reviews and stuff like that. Why don't after they finish doing designing this 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 uh, this shirt, uh, most especially the t-shirt, why don't they maybe at least send you one, send this person one, just for reviews and tell you, would you please review this shirt for us and and speak to your panel and speak to your fans, let them mm. know how they feel about it, if we can improve. Give it to you and then you wear it on the shirt and then you ask us, how do you feel about the shirt? Well, but, and then they give it to, for example, who, who, those people that... Are... Yes! Yes, but they, sh and they should do it, right, my brother. It, it could help a lot. It could boost a lot of sales. Like, mm. you give it to people like... uh. Uh, Lady Pogba, you give it to people like Lady Pogba, she mm, follows mm, football mm. you give it mm. to people that are clueless about football they will just mm. review about how beautiful it is, like the ladies yeah. guys, I received this from from solos what, what? Mm. you give it to the ladies, you give it to the gents we know football, you give it to mm, us, we review mm, mm. Ray, we are going to buy that shirt, it's so beautiful mm. you mm. understand, so mm. I think what it, that's how a drip can at least improve, understand now, mm. on this thing, it's closing statement on this thing of E 
of of ama fans now yeah. i think uh, if fans uh, i once i once said on one live that what would happen if these teams t- took out at least ten thousand and host a one day tournament once a year. Yeah. Do you know how much ten thousand means to this team in the bottom, yeah, guys? Yeah, yeah, like yeah, yeah. at least once a year, Baroga can afford ten thousand, I'm sure. Solos can afford ten thousand, I'm sure. Why can you go and get a cheap a cheap trophy from somewhere? You'll paint mm. it with gold, somewhere you'll find a way. And then say, Hurry, this is the ten thousand, this is the trophy, and then you don't get to keep it, you celebrate with it, you bring it back, you give it prestige. Like yeah. it's a luxury, it's a luxury trophy. Yeah. Like you you, yeah. you 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 designed it and then uh, like you rebrand it. Let's say for mm. example, uh, uh, there's a certain team, it won the first one, you imprint its name there, and then mm. you leave a space, they celebrate with it the same way they do with the league. You celebrate with it and then you take it back. Now, yeah. Fetcher, you give them 10,000. My brother, they will die for that opportunity. Mm-hmm. I know teams that are playing for 5,000 till this day. When mm-hmm. they're playing with that 5,000, they go all out. I'm a tackles. They are mm. more vicious than the tackles of Amato and Abu Tlanti. So if they can do that, my brother, I'm telling you, Ori, definitely this place. I yeah. mean, I would say, I mean, I'm serious. Like if, like, if you do that, I'm telling you, my brother, uh, it's fine. I'm, if, mm. if you do that, like mm. uh you're gonna pick up sponsors and yeah. then you're like you're gonna get support from your locations yeah like you yeah, must yeah. you must interact with your, your with with a place where your team is based you mm. cannot build a team and say Uri, come support us and also this thing of them increasing the price when kaiser chiefs is playing is coming to your town you are mm. you are not killing kaiser chiefs mm. you're killing your own fans when are you yeah. trying you see it's selfish yeah. Why are you yeah. increasing the price? You want them to be 300 when Kaiser Chiefs is coming, for example. Mm. Why are mm. you doing that? You're not killing Kaiser Chiefs. Kaiser Chiefs will benefit F- at FNB when they play Sundowns, when they play Pirates. Why mm. are you doing that? You're not mm. killing Kaiser Chiefs. So, mm. Bona, let your fans come in in large numbers, my brother. Mm. Look what TS Galaxy did with mm. Zekelelo Pasa. Mm. The, 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 the Indebele Nation. All of them, they came there. What did they do? Mm. Thank you very much. No, no, thanks, 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 Henry. Thanks. When I like you so much, I don't know why you don't come to my show more often. How's that? Closing statements for tonight, my brother. Uh, you know, one thing Hendrik is doing here, uh, I like it. When you say you must put in his CV, me, I tried putting in my CV with this club's high court. I'm going to join Inter Miami as well. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be the spokesperson. Because I have PSL teams. Nakia Saudi. <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> they need they need guys like you that say. Uh, so closing statement. Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry about that. Uh, somebody was calling me. Uh, okay, mm. let me just wrap it up quickly. Uh, can you hear me? Yeah, no, I can hear you. I can hear you. I can hear you. Okay, no, I thought it was my network. Okay. Uh, closing statement. More clubs should look uh, into localizing their sponsors. Okay. I know it's a difficult ask. Mm. I know it's difficult for us to adjust from what we used to be. But mm. then there's the problem. We used to be. We mm. are not. Mm. You know, Morocco Solos, we speak of Morocco Solos going back to its original name. But mm. guys, let's think, let's put ourselves in the shoes of the sponsor. Mm. Mm. You guys, are, are, you were sold, you came back as Solos, now mm. you are Morocco Solos. Mm. You know, as a sponsor, I'm looking at that going, but then there's a lot of dysfunction going on there. Mm, if mm, I put mm. my money there, how sure am I that next year, literally next year, mm. am I going to still be in the PSL? Or yeah, are they going to yeah, be yeah. sold or be renamed? Those things go, uh, are the things that uh, sponsors look uh, into when they, mm. when, they, when they look uh, at clubs. You know, mm, mm, Our mm, clubs mm. currently cannot be trusted. Mm. You cannot trust them because mm. of the things that do, especially the small clubs. So, mm. uh, our our, our sponsors helps in that sense that you know there's a little bit more of communication yeah 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 I, um, what's happening uh can i i will join tomorrow because now this call seems like it's important okay no stress no stress no stress uh ronnie yes, you're yes, not the only it. one no stress ronnie not the only one who's popular carry 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 at late at night. <laughs> uh, Ronnie, can, can, can you give me a closing statements for tonight? Look, man, look, man. Um, I think teams uh, need to start giving back to the community. That, that that's the first thing first. Yeah. You know, there's there's good amount team Do you understand me? Mm. Chiefs donating ten balls 
to 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 coming to Middlelands and donate to ten teams, five mm. balls, five balls. Mm. Uh, even if 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 the jerseys are not the same quality as as the Chiefs one, giving those clubs the under tens, under what what all those things, bringing uh, taking uh, the small tournaments with with the Mati Mosekas. What is yeah. wrong with that? Hey, hey, what hey. is wrong with it? I can see, I can see. Let's like my go, go. Chiefs, Chiefs, I'm, I'm just putting Chiefs because Chiefs is a big brand. Yeah. Going to Orange Farm, going to Orange Farm, mm. taking all the teams as the Orange Farm with under 13, under 17, going to a one ground, even if it's a, it's a dusty ground, mm. play, and then uh, 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 maybe Ukune pitch up, guys. Mm. Mm. Small things, small mm. things, you know, small mm. things become big. Making a small tournament, as Marcus Henry put it, the way he put it, about 10,000 red. Buying kids, I'm a kid, and all those mm. things. Mm. And then donate. Or mm. after playing, after playing, they, they take off all the, the, the jerseys that they use on the day. Those mm. those small boys from the development and leave them to, to those teams. Mm. What is wrong with that? Yeah. yeah what is yeah. wrong with that? Yeah. I, I, th- I, th- I think teams, man, they, they're, they're selfish. They, they think they're running the teams as business. That's mm. truly... They, they're not giving back to the community. Mm-hmm. And at the end of the day, I'm a, I'm a coach, so I say, they, they, develop, they develop these boys, then they come and steal, and then they make money out of those boys. And mm-hmm. then those guys from Soweto, they don't give even even a single cent. Yeah. So you, you see you see how, how, how greedy these guys are. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. my problem. Mm-hmm. That is my problem. So giving back to the community is one of the biggest things that they can do. Give mm-hmm. back to the community. Simple. Mm-hmm. How you do it, that we don't care. Give back mm-hmm. to the community. Mm. Once off, once off, in three months, if you can bring how much is I five if in, in Naturena, if you go to Naturena in, in, in a development, there are boxes. Mm. 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 Boxes, boxes. Mm. Mm. When you go to Safa and, and on the basement, there are boxes of mm. Amal and Juzan. The the, the Ekas, you know, they've been selling those t- the, those uh, Am- Amatis way we are Fana Bafana to teams. Teams are using Bafana Bafana Jesus, which which have been sold to from I don't know who's who's Uban Wakipa and you know, all those yeah. things. Do you understand what I'm trying to say? Mm. Why mm. can't you give it to the guys Amana Ama team? Why can't mm. you do that? Mm. Why can't you do that? Th- that yeah. is my problem, man. In Dobsonville, uh, uh, Solus is using Dobsonville. There's there's a ground outside the stadium, two grounds. Why can't you host a tournament there? Mm, mm, mm. Yes, Solus, host a tournament out there. Mm. You you fishing you fishing the teams. You fishing players. You also giving back to the community. Yes, teams yes. are greedy. That is the problem that we're having in South Africa. We mm. are greedy. We only think of, of our pockets and all that. Mm. We don't think of the guys who are developing these young guys. That's the problem mm. that I'm having. You're running a team from your own pocket. You do everything. You travel with these boys. You do go around and all those things. Mm. They are not getting anything. At the end of the day, um, when when they go and ask knock in chiefs, you should say I have I have went for for courses of coaching and all those things. They look at your face first. Back to back, pay to to and then they mm. don't care about you. Mm. They don't mm. even come and watch you coaching the the young guys. Eka so we'll see how are you coaching them? Let's see how mm. you coaching them. Mm. Let's see how the progressing of the teams. Mm. Yeah, they don't do that. Mm. They don't mm. adopt teams. Adopt teams. I want adopt my team Mosekas. Mm. Oh, Kize, oh, Mam Kize, he's driving millions, millions of cars. I don't know, I don't know. Why do you have to to have fifteen cars in your in your yard if mm. somebody's hungry out there? Mm. Just think about that. Mm. That, that, no. that is how greedy they are. Okay, last thing. <laughs> if I think that, sorry, man, I'm done with this. Um, Zuka Manja, I'm coming back. Just just two minutes. Zuka Manja, on the thirtieth, right? Yeah. It was his last day. At Pirates, yeah. mm-hmm. he was not extending. He didn't have an extension. Mm. So it's the same as Billiard's story. Zuka Maja didn't, didn't have didn't have a contract with Pirates until the thirtieth. So Zuka Maja, if he went to Spain, we, he was going to give Pirates and plenty time to sign him. Mm, 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 mm. So for him to make up a story to go back to Zimbabwe to say there's a family crisis is to buy time to to not sign, okay, and to be away from pirates. That mm. is what happened to Zuka mm, Manja. Zuka Manja mm, mm. didn't sign an extension with pirates. Mm. He didn't sign anything. Mm. On the thirtieth, it was his last day. 
Mm. On the 1st of uh, July, it was, um, he was a free agent. Mm, 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 mm. So Zugamanja, he was, he's a free agent from me from the 1st of July. That, that mm. is the story that, that, a key story that I can give you. Mm. Zugamanja didn't have a contract with Pirates after the 30th. So okay. if he went to Spain with them, he was going to, 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 to be, to be captured in a way you're saying you have to sign. Yeah. 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 You okay. understand me? If he traveled with them to Spain, they were going mm. to buy time. Think about it. They were, they were, they were having it three weeks. They started on the third, I think, if mm. not the, around four, somewhere there. Mm. So mm. from that time, they were... He, I, I know you. I, I hope you understand where I'm going. No, I hear so, you. I hear you. So yeah. for him to go out, he had a month. They gave him a month, right? A, 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 they gave him a salary to go and fix his problem, but mm. for him, for them to give him the salary, it was to say come back to us. Yeah, yeah. So after yeah. that, he had, doesn't have a contract with Pirates mm. anymore. So he's a free agent. For him to go to Supersport, he already manufactured that long time ago. Mm. And um, Gavin Hunt is one of the guys who are, who, who, who was there. Then the, the, he signed. I think he signed even a pre pre contract with with. With with Supersport, yeah, so he he was having a contract with Supersport already, okay. the, the pre-contract. So he, he didn't want to disclose this because yeah. he was going to be victimized at Paris. That mm. is that is the problem that we are having. Same thing that Chiefs did to Billiard, yeah. happening at Paris. Now they're, they're releasing that statement to say uh, whatever, whatever. Uh, uh, they are releasing him. They are not releasing him. He was a free mm. agent. Mm, 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 mm. That is a lie. Clean lie with Paris. Is a free agent. Okay, no. That's what I can tell you. Thanks. Th I no, I had a feeling. That's why when we spoke about <laughs> it yesterday, I had a feeling, or man, this is PR. But thank you so much, Ronnie, uh, for joining oh, me today. Thanks um, so much. Everybody else, I'll be back tomorrow, half past twelve, Monday to Friday, half past twelve in the afternoon. I'm here, and then also Monday to Wednesday at eight p.m. I'm here in Gwacha. Eight p.m. An hour and 30 minutes after, my brother. So, um, yeah. So, thank you guys for joining me. Please, if you want to watch the previous lives, they're on Facebook. Please follow the account if you haven't followed. And then follow me over on Facebook, too. There's other soccer content that is there, uh, football content that is there, too. Um, so, please check that out and support me there, too. Thank you guys for joining me tonight. Um, I, will see you, I will see everybody tomorrow, half past 12 in the afternoon. Bye, guys. Thank you to my panel.